Just as North Tonawanda rededicated its Veterans Memorial Wall and Roll of Honor last week, we found Richard Kyle. After enlisting in 1940 at age 18, he helped support B-17 bomber crews with the 388th Bomb Group flying from England to dangerous bombing missions into France and Germany where many were killed or shot down. And the flight crews that would fly into a combat situation one day and face all the enemy fighter planes and flak, sometimes they would make it through and sometimes they wouldn't. But two or three days later, they'd be back. If they were all together, they'd be back, ready to go into battle again. The bravery of these men was phenomenal and they always knew what they were facing. Kyle also recalled seeing some of the American troops on coastal areas in England preparing to go into battle for the wave of landings on the Normandy beaches and trying to write letters to their families and loved ones back home with the definite chance of dying on those beaches under German guns. I remember walking along the English Channel Beach where GIs were sitting there waiting their turn for the landing on Normandy. It was people, you know, the bravery that you can't imagine. Some of them scribbling little notes, little last notes. They stepped up. They stepped up and faced what they had to face. I'd just like for the people to know that we had the bravest bunch of soldiers that you could imagine. <laughs>